Good evening everyone. I hope you are all having a wonderful time. So lately I have uploaded a vlog about the night vibes in Bangkok and especially about the nightlife. But lots of subscribers and viewers ask me what about other touristic areas in Bangkok. So tonight's vlog is about again about Bangkok night vibes but in some other touristic areas. So I'm gonna show you around. We're gonna start from BTS Chitlong. We are going to walk around Central World and after that we are going to Siam and from Siam to MBK. So it will be a very interesting vlog. Let's walk and talk. So as I said, my friends, we have arrived to BTS Chitlom and from there we are walking now towards Central World. This is the Racha Prasong Bridge. We're gonna take the shortcut to the right. So if we continue directly, we can go to Siam. But first of all, I'm gonna show you Central World. So we are going to take this shortcut. This is Geisrom village. You can walk through and from there you can access Racha Prasong bridge and Central World. So first of all, let us explore around Central World. And after that, we are going to head to Science. So as I said, this is Geisrom village and you can take this shortcut if you want to go towards Pratunam or access Central World, one of the fanciest malls in the area. Usually it's not busy, but one of the best things in this mall is once you enter, it smells so good. It has lots of beautiful decorations as you see. Maybe lots of you don't know about this mall. This is between Chitlom and Central World. I usually take this shortcut to access Pratunam or Central World. But as I said, once you enter, it's air conditioned, smells very good because there are lots of shops, sells here aroma, aroma stuff. And everything inside this mall is so fancy. So it's around 6.30 now. And it's the best time to vlog because it's not hot and we can walk and talk and enjoy this vlog. So as I said at the beginning that lately I have uploaded a vlog about the night vibes in Bangkok but it was especially about the nightlife situation. So lots of people ask me what about other places in Bangkok. So we have started today's vlog from Chitlom and I'm gonna try to cover up almost every place that is beautiful in this area. All right, my friends, now we are on the bridge and let me show you where we are exactly. Uh, this is Central World. And if you walk directly like this, you can go to Pratunam. Today's vlog, we are going to explore Central World, Siam, and also MBK. All these places, you can access them by just walking, if you love walking. So as a general idea, you have lots of malls and markets in this area, like this one, the market. It's also a nice and fancy mall. And if you look like this, you have the Big C supermarket. So this area is full of markets and malls. So now we are walking towards Central World. Let me give you an idea. If you walk directly like this, you can go towards Pratunam. And if you go on this bridge, you can go to Platinum Fashion Mall, as you see. So, as I said, there are lots of malls and markets in this area. But now we are walking towards Central World. Here you have a big Shirin for prayers. Let me show you before we walk down. Usually it's busy at night time to pray and meditate. So now let's walk down and check around Central World. So that was the bridge we came from. As you see, my friends, let me show you again. This is the Racha Prasong Bridge. And now we are entering Central World. I'm gonna show you a little bit around before we go towards Siam.
Now, if you are wondering what you can do in Central World, Central World is one of the famous fancy shopping malls, but usually in front of Central World, there are always events, food courts, and lately there were the Christmas tree decoration, as I uploaded in my Instagram. If you are not following our Instagram, then you can follow. It's called also Live Love Thailand. So as I said, there will be lots of interesting events in front of Central World. Now we are walking from Central World towards Siam. But before we go to Siam, I'm going to show you the Apple store that is located at the end of Central World. It's really interesting. It's a big Apple store. And I'm sure once you are in Bangkok, you should visit this Apple store. There are always lots of promotions if you love Apple items. So let's walk and show you the Apple store before we walk towards Siam. And here we are. Uh, this is the Apple World in Central World. Now we are not going to enter inside. That's not the topic of tonight's vlog. But this is also part of the night vibes in Bangkok. As you see, lots of people inside, shopping, Apple lovers. And as I said, if you are here, there are always promotions in this place. So this is the Apple store that is located at Central World. Now we are going from here to Siam. Let me show you a little bit around before we go to Siam. So my friends, as you see, uh, that was Central World. Now we are going to walk up and take the bridge again towards Siam. So now we are inside the center world, as you see, beautiful decorations and there are some people shopping around and enjoying some fancy shopping because center world is all about fancy shopping. You can find all the famous brands in this mall, so if you want such brands Central Wall is one of the fanciest malls in the area. But now we are not making a review about Central World. I'm just showing you around since we started today's vlog from BTS Chitlom and we covered Central World. I'm gonna show you a little bit around and then we are going back to Siam. So that was a general idea about Central World, one of the fanciest malls in the area. If you love fancy items. Now we are walking from the bridge towards Siam. So if you want to walk from Central World towards Siam, it's very easy. It's around three to four minutes walking on this bridge. So let's head to Siam. And from there, we are going to explore what is the situation of nighttime around Siam. All right, my friends, now we are at Siam Station. As you see, this is one of the busiest stations in Sukhumvit that intersects Sukhumvit with Silom Line. So let me give you an idea. We came from that way, walking directly from Central World, and it took about three minutes. There are lots of people. It's Sunday, and it's early, it's seven. So this is Siam Paragon one of also fanciest malls in the area we're gonna enter from here show you a little bit around and after that i'm gonna show you siam center so let's go inside and continue our vlog from there so welcome to siam paragon one of the fanciest and luxury malls in the area 
As you see, these are all famous brands, Gucci, and people are standing in line because there is a promotion and Thai people and everyone, not only Thai people love promotions. We all love to save. So let me show you a little bit around and you're gonna have an idea about this fancy mall and look at the brands. I'm not going to read all the brands because my heart will stop. They are all so fancy. Now let me show you a little bit around and there is a food court downstairs if you like to eat food. So this is Siam Paragon and this is a general idea about this place. It's always busy, every day. It's not that today is Sunday, it's always busy. And yes, all the people that are shopping here are from another level. It's not like Chatuchak we can market. Another promotion, another place people are standing in line. What is this? Celine. All right. I don't have any idea. So it's selling girls bag. Maybe there is 50% discount on it. And another one. If Saint Laurent. I think girls are interested in such things more than our fellas. But as I said, tonight's vlog is about the night vibes in Bangkok in some of the famous areas in downtown Bangkok. We have covered about the nightlife. It's a disaster. The nightlife still needs time to operate. But other than that, everything is beautiful in Bangkok. All right, that was a general idea about Siam Paragon. Now we are going outside to show you a little bit Siam Center, usually there are always events in this area. So as I said, if you come here, everything is beautiful. Yep. And it's crowded. All right, guys, let's see what's happening here. This is in Siam Center, people are using their cameras i don't know for what uh, i think it's not about me nope i'm not that much famous uh, look at this guys uh, everybody is taking pictures and there is some event happening here i don't know what's the event so let's check it out uh, this is Sam Center and the famous fountains. So there is here also you can do some sportive activities, scootering, karting. And I don't know if they are taking pictures of this BTS, this famous band in Asia. And there is here a transformer. So I hope you are enjoying this night vibes from Bangkok. We're not going to enter Siam Center. It's same, same like Siam Paragon. So let's walk back. Look at this beautiful sky train, fountains, lots of people. These are the night vibes in Bangkok. And as we said at the head of the vlog, Bangkok is alive and everything is better now. We're not talking about the nightlife. This vlog is not about the nightlife. We are talking about generally what's going on in Bangkok at nighttime. So if you want to come to Thailand, if you want to enjoy Bangkok, welcome. This is the situation. Still, they are taking pictures. All right, I'm gonna look there. And I think it's about these people. Sorry if I don't know about them, but it seems that they are so famous in Thailand or Asia. Another beautiful picture of sky trains passing in Siam. As I said, it's a station that connects between Silom and Sukhumvit line. So this is Siam Center. 
and from here we are going to walk thank you very much for the pictures all right thank you so much i'm just joking fellas so let's walk and show you also here the decoration now uh, thailand is getting prepared to celebrate the chinese new year so look at here you have a very nice place to take some beautiful pictures let me show you here and after that we are going to walk towards mbk now we are outside siam and we are walking towards mbk as you see that was siam now we are walking down the bridge and from here directly you can access mbk one of the famous malls in this area and along the way also we can show you uh, what is the situation in this area so it's really nice area to explore at night time lots of things to explore and the best part is that you can access everything you saw in this vlog by just walking it's so easy it's not complicated and i'm sure you can do the same once you are in bangkok and enjoying siam so we have started our tonight's vlog from central world and after that we have explored siam siam paragon siam world and as you see that was siam center and now we are walking towards mbk especially at night time it's busy this area and tonight is sunday i intentionally did this vlog at sunday so that you can see the real night vibes of bangkok at night as i said forget the nightlife for the time being if you want to come you can enjoy other things thailand is not only about nightlife now there are lots of people want to come and enjoy the nightlife but what can i say fellas nowadays if you are free you can come you can pass all these regulations you can enjoy everything you saw in this vlog so as you see now we are next to mbk we're gonna access mbk from here we're gonna go upstairs and access mbk mall and these beautiful lights on the bridge are one of the beautiful things that you can see if you come at night to mbk so let's go up and show you around So if you want to come to MBK, you can come to National Stadium BTS and from there you can access MBK directly. And from there you can access MBK Mall directly. So this is one of the good characteristics of MBK as Siam. Siam you can come to Siam Station and MBK you can come to National Stadium. But if you love to explore like the way I'm doing now, if you love to explore like I'm doing now, then this is it. This is around MBK. As you see from here, you can see the CIM and the beautiful sky trains passing by. This is the most liveliest place in Bangkok, in my opinion, because you can see all these sky trains passing by, take beautiful pictures and that's mbk mall so this is the best time to explore so if you love to explore these places the best time is after five or six and there you have ibis hotel if you want to stay around and this is as you see bangkok before it was written bangkok city of life but now it's gone that siam discovery and this is the beautiful bridge that I'm talking about. Look at this. It's really beautiful. And another sky train passing. And here you can have lots of beautiful pictures. And everyone will know that you are in Bangkok. 
So keep that in mind. You can post lots of beautiful pictures on Instagram. You can check our Instagram account and see what I'm talking about. Look at these beautiful pictures from MBK. So my friends, that was our third stop of tonight, MBK, MBK Center. And as you see, it's so beautiful to be here at night time to take some beautiful pictures. So keep that in mind. Now I'm going to show you a little bit in front of MBK. And after that, we are going to end tonight's vlog. Well, my friends, that was the end of our vlog. The last pictures you saw from a new market next to MBK, it's called Donkey. Yes, it's called Donkey, I'm not mistaken. And it has a song, Donk, 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 Donkey. You will hear it all the time once you are inside. So I bought these chocolate chips. I'm gonna enjoy it till I reach the BTS. I hope you enjoyed also this vlog. So as you see, Bangkok is alive. And if you want to come, you can come and enjoy beautiful night vibes. So thank you for watching. Stay tuned and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.